still broke. Hey guys, it's uh, kind of an off day here today. It's actually been an off week. We got some rain yesterday. We got about an inch. We got even more rain today. Um, I soil sampled earlier in the week. We've been working in the shop and doing some odds and ends things. Nothing that I've really made a video about. But today, Molly and I are gonna go into town, kind of do some odds and ends, and errands, and figure, kind of take you guys around uh, with us and show what I kind of do on an off day. Enjoy. Well, I get this two wing. So I got another one going in. I got to run another ad today. How much rain did you say you get? Inch and nine tenths. Yeah, when I got half an inch of that. Huh. You'll get some more. It's supposed to rain all afternoon. Yeah. We're in the shop here. Some of the things that we've been working on this week, this semi right here, it's air window won't stay up. Basically this part right here has gone bad. We got a new one of those ordered. The 8110, I broke, or the shifter broke uh, off in my hand when I was doing some soybeans, just finishing up doing the soybeans this year. So we got that and I got that put back in. That was kind of an intricate deal to do. And then the draft sensor for the three point arms, is messed up it's probably the voltage is out of range i ordered a new spring for it turned out that wasn't it so i gotta work on that some more i gotta go through and set the voltage range on that we just got a new bucket for the new kubota skid steer new to us kubota skid steer and it's got a little slop in the top of it um, so i gotta get a piece of metal and weld that in there so that bucket is tight across the road is the corn head we're gonna have to go through the corn head get it ready to go, get it cleaned up, um, put new sprockets on it, kind of do a little preventative maintenance on it. And then, in the lower shed here, if you guys can hear me, this tractor won't start, battery's probably dead, don't know why it went, went dead. This tractor right here probably had fuel gunk getting its system. And it wants to bog down, so I got to work on it, figure out how to get it fixed. And uh, the 9400 is still at the John Deere dealer, hasn't even been worked on yet. It's got leaking injector seals. Um, other than that, I think that's really the only things that are truly broken right now. But that's our shop projects going on. Um, not really a YouTube mechanic or anything like that, so I don't know if I'll make videos about fixing things because. Half the time I'm flying by the seat of my pants when I'm fixing things. But that's what's in the shop. That's what's getting worked on right now. Oh yeah, I about forgot the remote for this garage door stopped working. Don't know why. Specials. Oh. Midwest special, babe. You want some hope today? The hope was very good. <laughs> Yay, Molly, Walmart. Walmart, Molly. <laughs> so Walmart has a big display of uh, water going on right now because Lake Rathbun, which supplies all the water all the water for like 16 counties down here in southern Iowa had a toxic 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 algae bloom going on um, like last week and then this week they the lakes apparently turning over and the water stinks like horribly coming out of the faucet you can taste it like we just went to lunch and I ordered a Mountain Dew and you can almost taste it like in the ice. So everybody's drinking bottled water right now. And I cannot find these dang letters. Do you still believe in humanity? 
Nope, that's usually a side effect to Walmart. Go home for 10 minutes. Okay, so so far, um, so we've gone to lunch, uh, went to Walmart, had to go to Walmart to get some, uh, like, the sticker signs for my uh, cover crop plot. We just drew on them with Sharpies really thick. That didn't last very long. The sun faded them really quick. So I got some of those stickers that you put on the mailbox there. And then Wayne wanted a new pair of slippers, so I picked up a new pair of slippers. And now we're on our way to a decal guy that's making me some decals for a semi. They've been standing on the corner, talking for about 15 minutes now, while I just been sitting in this truck. Life of a farmer. They do a lot of talking. Okay, semi semi stickers are ordered. I ran into somebody that I knew there doing the same thing that I was. So of course we sat there and talked about egg for half an hour while Molly was sitting here waiting. Pretty sure she really enjoyed that. Now I'm running up here to go get my uh, mailers made for our open house for my business so if anybody's in the area that watched my YouTube videos September 17th I'm having an open house leave a comment I'll get you an invite sent and then I think I'm pretty much done for the day and can head back to the shop to work on something else let's go get these cards see if this visit takes half an hour what you want to bet all right the mailers are done I'm gonna run Molly home now that she's been fed uh, I'm going to go then meet up with my dad, talk about uh, putting some technology into our new combine, well, new to us combine for, ha for harvest this fall, and then probably work on a couple of things. It sounds like some parts came in for that semi, but that's kind of how a uh, rain day, odd ends day kind of goes in uh, the life of a young farmer. So thank you guys for watching, and we'll catch you on the next video. Wrong aisles, wrong aisles.